Look at Thomas, where you and I are now. As of 3rd June, we are at 152,920 registered voters. The last election we had in excess of 357,000 registered voters. Who come? Gaan registreer die mensen niet meer niet. Wat gaan aan? Look at Ohangwena. Ohangwena, one of the most populous regions in this country, is at 3 to 6 July 2024. No, let me correct. Is between 3rd June to 6 July. Ohangwena is at 87,000. 441 registered votes. Same with Omsati, 85,230. You look at Ochodonjupa, 57,800. What is going on? Zambesi, 26,307. What is happening? Kavango East, 52,320. Erongo, 76,000. Taras, 36,005. What is happening? Have we given up on politics? We can make as much noise as we want on social media. If we do not urge all Namibians who are eligible to vote to go and register, all our crying, all our complaints are not going to bring about change. What we need to do is ensure each and every person, we, even if we have to get wheelchairs if they can't walk, even if we have to provide cars, even if we have to walk, we must make sure everyone is the registered voter. Speaking at a public meeting in Bantuk, the LPM leader also reminded people why they should vote for the party. Suartu Boy said the party's guiding principle is Namibia first. With a focus on working hard to improve the living standards of all citizens by ensuring that the issue of land, sanitation, employment, food insecurity, gender-based violence and basic income grant are addressed. A vote for LPM is a vote for economic freedom and social justice. We are of the view that given the growth of hunger in society, that ours will be a government that must look at the provision of a hunger grant, not food, a grant for young people and those that are unemployed so that they can actually go and buy their own food. We can't dream dreams. We can't speak of visions of development while people have not eaten for four, five days consecutively. Swartboy also noted that the LPM will make youth empowerment mandatory if it comes into power. You will determine for the people of this country whether older politicians can go home early or whether they will stay and frustrate everyone else. Your maturity, your growth, your sense of responsibility. We want to see it while we are still a bit strong so that we can in all comfort say we have done our part, go run with it now. The public meeting held under the theme Embracing Cultural Diversity also included entertainment activities. Jelena Fuka, NBC News, Bantuk.